This color really suits me. I'm sick of this! Sweetie, what's wrong? What are you wearing? Ugh! You're horrible and stupid! <laughs> Cut it. We got it. Awesome! Did everything turn out right? No! This won't do at all. Let's refilm. There needs to be amazing trash content on my blog. This is the 10th take already! I'm sick of it! I'm your daughter, not your servant! You are my daughter, and you should listen to your mother. Oh, excuse me, and hello. I just heard yelling, and the door wasn't locked. And who are you? <clears throat> Allow me to introduce myself. I'm Chris, a family psychologist. Wow, the best psychiatrist of the year? Yes, yes. I see that not everything's going smoothly in your family, and I can help you solve all your problems. We have a great relationship. We don't need a psychologist. I knew that you didn't care about me. Are you still here? The door is over there. Got it. I'm going. But I'll still leave my business card. Get out. You're the boy of my dreams. I only want to be with you. You're everyone's crush and my hero. <gasps> awesome. It's a smash. Zach will definitely notice you with this song. Oh, I really hope so. We need to practice more. You're the boy of my dreams. <laughs> I only want to be with you. <laughs> <laughs> um, um. Hey, kitty, what's wrong? Zach will definitely fall in love with you. Really, really. I'm not crying about Zach. <laughs> my mom doesn't care about me. She isn't even interested in my life at all. <laughs> my poor kitty. Gosh, could kitty be right and I'm a bad mother? I guess I really should go to the psychologist. Where's his business card? Your mother loves you. Don't be upset. No! She only thinks about herself. She even bought my guitar in the color that she likes. Kitty, don't do that. I've had it! Oh, no! You'll regret it later. Sweetheart, I'm coming. What is it? Do you need to film a new vlog? But of course, that's the only reason you need me! What's wrong, my treasure? We're going to see that family psychologist. But you didn't want to. I'll do anything for you. Well, that's about it. I hope that you'll listen to my advice. And everything will work out for you. Of course. My daughter and I will try really hard. Right, darling? Mm-hmm. If you need something, call. I'd be glad to talk to you. Nice, nice, nice. From this day on, we'll be the best mother and daughter. Nothing's going to change in just one day. Oh, it's your classmate Anita. We need to call her over here. Anita! Mom, no! The psychologist said to talk to your friends more. Anita, sit with us. We're not friends. She's my enemy. Hello? Hi, Anita. I'm Ariel, Kitty's mom. Do you want to eat with us? Why not? Oh, no. Wow, look at those nails. This color's a dream. Thanks, Mrs. Ariel. You can just call me Ariel. By the way, do you know if there are any vegan salads here? There's so many calories in meat. You count calories too? Wow. By the way, I have a special app for that. I'll show it to you. <gasps> I have the same one. We're so similar. Look at that. They're similar. <sighs> Kitty, where are you going? Home. I can see that you'll have a fantastic time without me. Then Anita and I will hang out a little more. By the way, have you seen Gucci's new collection? Of course. And we can watch Versace's new show today together. <gasps> I'm in. You mean your mom spent all day with her? 
Yes, they're like best friends. Ugh, sickening. Well, she... <laughs> Look who's coming! Zack? He's coming toward me. Okay. Go on, kitty, pull yourself together. It's time to sing him your song, and he'll definitely ask you on a date. Ugh, oh, you're right. Hello, lovely. I'm ready. You wouldn't. You're the boy huh? of my dreams! Kitty! Yes. Kitty, stop! What was that just now? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know either. So, will you give me your number? Of course. Mm. See you, lovely. Bye, Zach. Uh, right. Bye, Mary. <laughs> Not only did you embarrass yourself, he doesn't even know your name. <laughs> Leave me alone. <gasps> I think she's coming. Hi, Mom. Um, what are you doing? Oh no! Does it hurt a lot? You need a bandage! Or should I call an ambulance? Ah! What should I do? <laughs> you should have seen your face. <laughs> I'll put this on my blog. <laughs> What's this? It's a prank. You're out of your mind. I almost passed out. You're insane. The psychologist said to add humor to our life. Wasn't it funny? <laughs> ha ha ha! Just hilarious! You didn't like it? Strange. Anita really appreciated this idea. Anita? That idiot should get a scare herself! Don't say things like that! Anita's a good girl! That's all, don't get upset! Eat up! I made you a salad! You eat this grass! Or go give it to Anita! Are you sure the teacher isn't in her office? I'm sure, open the door. All right. Uh, it's locked. Um, uh. Oh, just a sec. Uh. Ouch, nothing's going well for me today. How am I friends with you? The door opens the other way. Oh, why didn't you say so before? Uh. Eva? Ah, oh, Mrs. Jessica, I, uh, oh, it's you. Uh, what are you doing here? Nothing, what are you doing? Well, we were looking for the teacher. Uh, I also came to see her, but since she's not here, I'll get going. And what's this exactly? Hey, that's mine, give it back! Ugh. Hmm. Nate, look, the answers to the test are on here. Uh, I found it first! <laughs> But we need the answers, too. Then you should have come sooner. The early bird gets the worm. Nate, grab her. Just try. I have nails. I'm not going to take anything from you. Uh, my dad will punish me for bad grades again and lock me in my room. Huh. Okay. You can take pictures of the answers. Yay! Thanks, Eva. You're my savior. Uh, now let's leave. Eva, let's go. <sighs> Where is she? Here I am. Finally, I thought you weren't coming. What's wrong? Kitty isn't talking to me. She said that I don't understand her. Tell me what teenagers are into right now. Sure, but first, stop eating this poison. Is that the new bag from the new collection? I knew you'd notice. It's incredible. It's perfect. I wish I had one like that. If you want it, take it. Really? You'll just give it to me? Well, yeah, my dad knows the designer. He'll give me another one. <gasps> Thank you! 
is it? The door's open. Hello, Ariel. I came to find out how things are going with Kitty. I'm gonna go drink some water now. Actually, none of your advice works. Everything just got worse. Hmm, yeah. Your situation is more complicated than I expected. But I can help raise your spirits. We can go to the cafe or the movies. Are you asking me on a date? Well, yeah, why not? Oh, I think I'm interrupting. No, Chris is going now. But I... I said he's going. Straighten your back. Uh, Nate is looking at you. Really? Yeah, look, but don't be obvious. Uh, All right. Eva, did you hurt yourself? No. Did you want to do a somersault? Let me teach you. Ah. Wow, I want to too. Oh. First, you need to warm up. Like this. Oh, you know so much, and you're so strong. Well, that's true now. Do you remember me in fifth grade? Yes, you were so funny. <laughs> <laughs> Eva's lucky Nate likes her. Why can't Zach like me like that? He doesn't even notice me. Thank you for coming. But I'm afraid you need to leave before Kitty comes back. I understand. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Anita? Mom, did you drive this cow into our house again? You're the cow. Kitty, why are you so rude? Anita's a very sweet girl. This sweet girl has been bullying me my whole life. And she took my crush away from me. And you're friends with her? Anita would never. And if you mean Zach, she doesn't even like him. You even talk about boys with her? Mom, this is a betrayal. What do you mean? Do you want me to help you and Zach? You? Don't get involved. You'll just make things worse. He's so sweet and kind and strong. And he's just so amazing all around. Hmm. Cool. And he even said that I have pretty eyes. And he even... Stop it! Are we going to watch a film? Or are we going to talk about Nate? I'm sorry, I understand that Zach doesn't notice you, and so it's hard to hear. Mm. I'll be quiet now. Mom, are you kidding me? Huh? What? I can't hear you. Turn off the vacuum! Talk louder! Um, maybe we can go into your room? We can watch a the movie there. You kidding? You always ruin things for me on purpose! I just thought I'd do the housework. I'm sorry it bothered you. We're watching a movie! Because of you, I need to get more popcorn. Yes, she left. And she even forgot her phone. Uh, Mrs. Ariel, what are you thinking? I will let you read Kitty's I messages. I don't need to. I have a better idea. And you can help me with it. What are you doing? Be quiet. Tell me about the Zack. How does he get along with Kitty? Not at all. He doesn't even know her name. And she's totally crazy for him. What do you want to know? I want to help my daughter with her love life. Now we'll write Zack in her name. Where is he in here? Oh, I found him. Uh, maybe you shouldn't. No, I should. Oh, maybe I can send him a photo. Put this on. Why? Well, you look like Kitty. A bit. It'll look like she sent this photo. Uh, no. That's going too far. Right instead. Yes, you're right. Kitty will thank me for this. Hmm, maybe this really is a good idea. Kitty would never do this herself. I knew that you would support me. <laughs> okay. Hi there, Zach. And what emoji? Uh... That one. Send it. <gasps> he wrote, he wrote it. it! And he's writing something. Uh -huh. Where were you? I've been looking 
view to the whole house. And I can't find my phone. Your phone? No, no, I didn't see it. And I have to go. Better get ready for class. What about the movie? Another time. Bye-bye. She's strange today. Oh, here's my phone. How did it get here? Nate is so amazing, but he hasn't asked me on a date yet. Then ask him. Oh, no way. Hello, Eva. <gasps> Hi. Listen, have you seen the new UFO movie? Uh, no, I don't like movies like that. I prefer comedies. I see. Uh, but a new cafe opened up near here. They say they have amazing burgers. Awesome, but I'm a vegetarian. Right, I forgot. By the way, I've always wanted to go to a vegetarian cafe, but I haven't found anyone to go with. Uh, then take Zach with you. All right, I'll go ask him. There you go. He won't ask me on a date. He just did, though. Three times. Why do you think he was talking about movies, burgers, and how he didn't have anyone to go to the cafe with? Gosh, I'm such an idiot. Let's go to class, and then we can see how Zach reacts to you. Like usual, he won't care. No, your mom wrote to him from your phone. What? What did my mom do? Oops, I'm going to class. Eva, you'll pay for this. You're done for! Come here! Uh, Kitty, hi. I've been waiting for you. You were waiting for me? Well, yeah. I asked you to hang out yesterday, and you said that you'd tell me tomorrow in school. Me? I wrote that? Oh, yes. I wrote that. So you agree? You promised to sing for me. I'm sure that you wrote an amazing song. Thank you. Yes, it was good to write. I dream of becoming a singer. <laughs> Keep dreaming. You will never become a popular singer. You had better choose another profession. I will become one. No, and your mother doesn't think so either. Oh, my mother? Oh no, Zach, hold her. Ah! Uh, let me go! Kitty! Uh, fine! Fine! I'm calm! Really? Yes! Psycho! Shut up! Ah! Ah! Girls! I love spending time in the salon so much! I'm finished with the massage! Now I'll bring masks for your face and hands! Awesome! <sighs> Anita, what's wrong? It's Kitty. She attacked me and they barely managed to drag her away. What is this nightmare? Oh, I'm sorry. Well, put your hair back in order. But first, bring me a drink. All right, all right. Here's your drink. Just a couple minutes and then I'll fix your hair. How awful. How could Kitty do that? I'll have to talk to her. But first, I need to ask the psychologist for his advice. These were left for you. Whoa, do you have a secret admirer? There's a note. I'll wait for you at the cafe at five. You're Chris. <gasps> it's that psychologist. Great. You better wear your prettiest dress on the date. No, I'm not going anywhere. No, no, no. Why not? He's handsome and he likes you. And anyways, you wanted to ask him for his advice. I don't know. I need to think about it. What sort of think about when a handsome guy like that asks you on a date? A date? I haven't been on a date for so long. What if I do something wrong? Don't worry. Just go on the date and don't worry about it. I'm still very nervous. <sighs> How do I look? Will Zach like me? You look perfect. Let's go. The boys will be here soon. I agree with Eva. You're beautiful. I didn't ask for your opinion. And where are you going? Hanging out with dear little Anita again. Oh no, Zach and Nate are here. Fix my hair. Calm down already. Come in. Hi. Hi. Hello. 
Hello, boys. How are you, Zach? Mom, please don't. We need to go. Wait. What about my kiss goodbye? Mom, no! You can't go without a kiss. That's so sweet. Mom, go away! You're embarrassing me! Yeah, that's really sweet. But I'm not five years old. Stop it, Kitty. You don't want Zach to think you're hysterical. No. All right, guys. Let's go. Bye-bye. Be home by 11. All right. I have to go, too. Ariel. You look wonderful. What pretty flowers. <laughs> I chose them according to your cycle type. Take a seat. It's all so, so romantic. Well, yeah, it's a date. A real date? I'm not ready. I, I don't know. Shh. Don't say anything. I fell in love with you at first sight. I can't stop thinking about you. Actually, I liked you from the first moment, too. Gosh, what's with these cafes? Yeah, you're not allowed to sing in any of them. And I really wanted to hear Kitty's performance. Well, there's one cafe left where we haven't gone. I hope they'll allow it, but let me go first. I'll find out. Mom? Kitty? Uh, Chris and I are figuring out our therapy plan. I see what you're figuring out. Uh, well, do they allow it? Oh. oh, so there won't be a song? You're an idiot, Nate. Kitty, I'll explain everything. You'll explain that instead of solving our problems, you've started seeing our psychologist? I'm solving them, but Chris and I aren't in love. No, this is on purpose. It's all to spite me. You're ruining my life. <sighs> I've ruined everything again. <laughs> Uh, are you sure you don't want to invite your mom to your performance? No! I don't want to see her or hear her. That's why I came to your house. Don't ruin my mood. All right, I understand. Am I interrupting? I brought some food for you in case you get hungry before the performance. Oh, oh thanks, Mom. <laughs> By the way, I also got the stain out of your favorite dress. <laughs> you're the best mom in the world. And you're the best daughter. Oh, they're so happy. Why don't I have a mom like that? That's all. I won't bother you. Well, are you ready? Mm-hmm. Can't you call your mom anyways? Yes, you fought, but she still loves you. You're right. The last photo she posted was 10 minutes ago at the store. I'll go talk to her. Awesome. Uh, in the meantime, I'll tune the guitar and check all the equipment before the performance. <gasps> wow, just look at this dress. Mm -hmm. Stop being sad. I took you shopping on purpose to lift your spirits. Yes, yes, you're right. I'm in a wonderful mood. <laughs> Hey, what's wrong? Kitty hates me. She went to Eva's house and hasn't spoken to me for three days. She didn't even ask me to her performance. You'll make up, I'm sure. You'll see. <laughs> Mom, are you really with Anita again? And I wanted to make peace with her. <laughs> uh, let's go to Kitty's performance. We can make up with her there. She won't forgive me. <laughs> yes, she will. Let's go. <laughs> Everything's ready. We just need to wait for Kitty. Will there be popcorn? Of course not. You drown Kitty out with your crunching. Kitty! Uh, where's Miss Ariel? Don't even say her name. Kitty, is everything okay? Do you want to postpone the show? Everything's fine with me. Sit down. <clears throat> Are we late? Why did you show up here? I didn't ask you here. Darling, I couldn't miss your concert. Don't 
touch me. You have your new daughter there. Now let her perform. Sweetheart. I'll, I'll bring, bring her, her back. back. Let me do it. But she hates you. Trust me, I know what to say to her. <laughs> Here, take this. Go away! You already stole my mom from me. What else do you want? Well, it's true that Ariel and I became friends, but you're still her daughter and she loves you. She only wants what's best for you. Did she say that to you? Yes, she's very really worried about your fight. You are the best mom in the world, unlike mine. What's wrong with yours? Everything's wrong with her. She's constantly at work, on business trips, and I only see her once a month. And your mother cares so much. You need to make up. You're probably right. It's only because of her that I'm going out with Zach. By the way, Zach is still there waiting for your song. And I'll sing. Thank you. You're not such a jerk after all. You're cool too. <gasps> They're back! Well, did you talk? Yes, I'm sorry for being such an idiot, Mom. And you forgive me. I love you. Are we gonna have a song today or not? Mm, just hold on. Of course there will be. Saying I love you is not the words I want to hear from you. It's not that I need to, not because, but if you only knew how easy it would be to show me how you feel more than words. And all the things you do to make it real Then you wouldn't have to say That you love me Cause I'd already knew What would you do If my heart was turning to then you wouldn't make things real just by saying. Woohoo! Yeah! Fantastic. That was amazing. I fell in love with your voice and with you. Looks like I missed everything. Chris! Maybe we should have been Hug him! By the way, I congratulate you on your successful performance. And this is for the mother of this talented singer. Ooh, what's this? Will Kitty have a new dad? Well, it's too early to say. Anyways, Kitty. I don't mind if you go out. I'm happy for you. Really? Hooray! Hugs! <laughs> <laughs> These are my dumbbells. I took them first. No, I did. Give them to me now. What a nut job. Police! Police! The police won't help you. Uh, psycho. Uh, ah! uh, he is so handsome. Gorgeous man. Hello. He said hello to me. Wow, and to me too. Ah! It's all because of you. Be quiet. What are you doing? Just helping you exercise. Stop it and take away this chair. Oh, whatever. Oh, are you new to our gym? I've never seen you here before. And what's your name? Actually, I own this gym. And I've never seen you here. My name is Chris. Oops. Yeah, my name is Mia. Oh my goodness. So you own this gym, huh? Well, yeah. You are doing such a great job. Your wife must be so proud. My wife left me with two children 10 years ago. 
Perfect. This is my cue. I'm Cindy. Oh, sorry, but I gotta go. My workday's over. Mr. Chris, you wanna come over? Get to know each other better? We can go to my place or straight to yours. Yeah, right. I wanna come over too. Um, maybe some other time? I'm always happy to meet new people, but not today. I'm really tired. No, no, that's not how it's done. That's right. You can't say no to a lady like me. Well, if you want, you can leave me your phone numbers and I'll give you a discount for your next visit. Phone number? Of course, I'll leave it. Write it down. But mine first. No, mine. <laughs> You're so funny. Whew. I'm so beat. Stop, little one. Can't catch me. Can't catch me. Who let me eat my sandwich? I wanted to, so I ate it. Oh, come here. Come on, guys. Calm down. Papa, please tell her. Zach, she's your little sister. Let it go. <laughs> got it. Dad's on my side. As usual. Hey, that's enough. I got pizza. Whoa, awesome. Let's dig in. I'll have the biggest slice. Or better, two. Get lost, little snake. Dad, he's calling me names. There. Take that. Come on, kids, stop it. There. Oh, you. Enough! Had lunch all right. Who will clean it up? He she will. will! I see. Start cleaning now. Yes, hello. I'm listening. To go where? Why didn't they say so earlier? Fine, I'll think of something. Dad, what's wrong? Oh, I forgot that tomorrow's the opening my new gym. I have to be there. So you're leaving? Looks that way. I miss you so much. Bye bye. Well, I'll go pack. Yes. Oh. Quiet. We don't want my dad to hear us. Tina, are you scared to tell your dad that I'm here? No, my dad's not gonna be too happy that I'm dating someone. Maybe I should leave? No way. I promised you we'd be together and spend this evening alone. That's it. But how can we be alone when your dad and brother are behind that wall? Don't worry, we just gotta be quiet. Tina, open the door. Oh, Mandrake, hide. Where? Wherever you want. If Dad sees you, we're... No, no, you're done. Tina, I told you. Come on, hide under the bed. Jeez, there's so much dust in here, and I'm allergic to it. What took so long, and who are you talking to? I'm um, just memorizing the poem, yep, yep, the poem. Ah, choo. Who's that? Dad, I just sneezed at you. Didn't you see? Must be allergies. Fine. I have to decide who will keep an eye on you. Papa, we can take care of ourselves. Someone has to take care of my babies. But Dad, we're not little anymore. I'll go call the neighbors. Maybe we'll find someone. But Dad, don't. We can stay home alone. Come on, Drake. Go home. Date is canceled for today. Do you think I came here to lie under the bed? Well, I'm sorry. I'll call you later and we'll figure it out. Come on. Where can I find someone to babysit my children? I've called everyone. My friends can't do it. Same thing with the neighbors. I don't know what to do. Come on, move quietly. All my friends are busy and I don't know anybody else. But wait, I met those two ladies at the gym. Uh-huh. Hello, Mia. How are you? Remember you wanted to come over? Ah! Um, I have to leave for business. Could you babysit my kids? Oh, you don't have time? Okay, I understand. Uh, Papa, what are you doing? I'm trying to find a person who will stay with you. Go, I'm busy. All right. Hello, Cindy? Remember you wanted to come over? I have to leave. Do you mind looking after my kids? Ah, oh, you're busy. I see. What am I gonna do? Well, they'll have to stay home alone. Yay! Woohoo! We'll stay home alone! Dreams come true! Well, at least the kids are happy. Have a good trip, Dad. And good luck with opening. We'll miss you. But that's not for sure. Too bad. I couldn't find anyone to babysit you. But it's okay. Hey, hi there. I'm right here. Dad, um, who is this? Cindy? You said you couldn't come. 
I thought about it for a while and just couldn't say no. Especially say no to you. Great. Tina, Zach, you won't stay alone. You'll stay with Miss Cindy. What? what? Oh, Mr. Chris, I'm here to babysit your children. But you said you were busy. I decided to cancel everything, to come here. Now I can stay with your children forever. Um, can someone explain to me what's going on here? Children, meet Mia and Cindy. It just so happens that they're both gonna stay with you. But Dad, this is too much. We agreed to one person, but now there are two of them. Besides, these are ladies you barely know. These ladies go to my gym. I'm sure they're good people. Very good people, very. Besides, I have copies of their documents, addresses in my database, so don't worry about it. Just great. Now we have no choice. We'll have to stay. Perfect. I'll be back soon. Don't worry. Your kids will be just fine. <sighs> well? Why did you come here? I don't need your permission. I want Chris to become my husband. And you'll just be in my way. Well, I like Chris too. I'll do everything to be with him. Well, we will see. I'm sure his kids will like me more. And then you'll beat it. You're so rude. You're gonna fail. Of course I won't. I wonder, is our dad really so silly or just pretending to be? I have no idea. Only he could invite some random ladies to our house. But they are really weird. One looks like a demon, and the other one, like she's ran away from the kindergarten. Hey, kiddos. Show me where I'll sleep. I mean, show me your daddy's room. You just got here and want to sleep already? Well, yeah. And I really want to see the bedroom of my future husband. Oh, who is this pretty little thing? Look at her. Who is this pretty little thing? <laughs> Ow, it hurts. Did you even wash your hands? Of course. I wash my hands every half hour. For real? You have to wash them? Oh my gosh, I think I'm gonna go. Whoa! What is it, Tina? Are you hurt? Looks like I'll have a bump on my head now. Oh, wait. I'll call an ambulance, the police, and all rescue services. Boy, you're nuts. Get up, Tina. Stop whining. Here you go. Why does it stink so much? It's coming from you. <laughs> Maybe you want to feed us. Nope. I won't leave you hungry. Come with me. Yeah, go, and I'll chill a little. So, uh, will we have some lunch? Well, yeah. So feed us already. Um, kids, the thing is, I don't really know how to cook. I see. So we'll starve after all. <sighs> I'll think of something. Oh. Mwah. You sure you understand what this pan is for? Well, yeah. We're cooking, of course. But you can't cook jewelry. Really? Not even the gold bars? Bars of actual gold? Oh, I'll go get the diamonds for my other purse. Tina, put it all into your pockets as fast as you can. Got it. Unbelievable. Now we can buy whatever we want. Uh. Uh, a legit burp. The best one in a long time. Holy moly. I've never heard a burp like that. I'm a pro at this. Where is that nutcase? When to get diamonds. Oh, cool. I can steal them later. Okay, now I'm gonna feed you. My stomach is growling so bad. Don't worry. It's for the best. Means you'll be slim. Good sandwiches. Wait. First, I gotta warm them up. We'll do it then. Almost done. I'd eat them even cold. Uh, you better tell me about your dad. I see he's a rich single man. He must need a wife. I don't think our dad needs a relationship. Oh, but I need him so much. When I saw your dad, I immediately realized... Realized what? Now tell me everything. Um, well, that he's a very good person, raising two children on his own. Oh, all done. Yeah, we're not eating today. Um, looks that way. 
Well, can we eat already? Uh, Tina, here you go. Cindy made us a fancy meal. Uh, why is it all black? Uh, she added some cuttlefish ink. Oh, wow, well, then I get it. Ew, Zach, what is this? Ha <laughs> gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> Jeez, you can't do this. Why? Now I can laugh at you and show everyone too. <laughs> <laughs> Yuck, Zach is nuts. Well, brushed your teeth? Leave me alone. Oh, come on, it was a cool prank. My next prank will make you forget your name. Well, guys, it's time to clean up. Uh, Quincy's. Um, and I, uh, and I have important stuff to do. Hey, it's not up for discussion. I have to do my best to make your dad like me. Why don't you get out of here? My show's about to start. We'll do the cleaning. Oh, and I'd love to get out. Man, but cleaning is so boring. Hey, you broke the glass. So what? Their daddy's rich means he can buy a new glass. I'm the one in trouble. Nothing to drink juice from. Ooh, I know. You don't even care that it's the cup I won at the dance contest? Do you even care that I'm thirsty? There's no clean glasses in your house. Jeez, we gotta call dad and tell him everything. Wait, I think this will change your mind. Yeah, of course. I already forgot what I wanted to do. You're a sellout, Zach. And I will give you more, Tina. Yeah. Oh, oh, okay then. Beat it already. You're really bothering me. So what are we going to do? I don't know. Uh, maybe it's good these ladies stayed with us. Mia gave us lots of money. Cindy didn't really do anything, but she's funny. Let's wait. Maybe it's going to get better. Hey, little ones. Give me the ball. Haven't played in forever. Reminds me of my childhood. Well, yeah. <laughs> this was probably a long time ago. Do I look so old? Well, could look better. Uh. Oh, it's gone. Who's younger goes to get it. Uh, as usual. It's okay, kiddos. I hope we'll become friends. If not, I'll make you. Oh no, it hurts so bad. I went into the bushes and scratched my hand. Should we go to the doctor? Make sure there's no infection? Go to the doctor? Come on, I'll take care of it. Ugh. Oh, all done. Ew, the band-aids are disposable. We gotta save money. <laughs> I want something sweet. Perfect. Exactly what I need. Mmm. So good. Mmm. Are you eating the cake all quiet? Well, of course. I don't want to share. Give me a piece. I want some too. Yeah, right. Go clean up or whatever you were up to. Don't tell me what to do. Chris will be coming back really soon. Then you will fly out of here like a snot in a tissue. Oh, yeah? Like snot in a tissue? If you want, I'll give you some cake. All right, couldn't you do it right away? Here. Hey, what have you done? <laughs> well, yummy. You did it on purpose. What a snake. Bon appetit. And yes, when Chris comes back, only I'll stay here. Got it? I'm so tired of you. Chris will be mine. No, mine. What an absolute nightmare. That snake ruined my face. So many calories got on my cheeks from this cake. I'm guessing you can't share something again. Yeah, your da, 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 da. Cool song, right? No. Well, okay. Where are you going? I want to go out with Drake, my boyfriend. Oh, that's my son's name. Can you imagine? But I'm against all of this. I don't even let my son go on dates. Poor guy. Um, do you want to do a mask? Well, okay. Now we wait 15 minutes. Jeez, what did you do to the girl, you monster? It's a face mask. Man, you're nuts for sure. Do you want to do a mask? I can't put it on. Calm down. Harmony comes from within. This is nonsense. Uh, she's so weird. Tina, time to take off the masks. Tina, get up. Oh, where? 
Did I oversleep? No, it's okay. It's only 3 p.m. Oh no, I have to be in the cafe in half an hour. Zag, help me. Whoa, how did you manage to tangle your hair so bad? I don't know, but now I'm running late. Calm down, I'll just pull and that's it. Hey, I don't want to be bald. Um, well, then you won't be hot. Just be careful. Let's go. Oops. What is it? What happened? Oh, nothing. I'll be back right away. Did I hear a noise? I don't know what to do with my hair. I look like a hobo. Don't even have a straightener to straighten it. But you have an iron. So what? You think this will work? Well, that's what I'm always doing. Why does it smell like it's burning? I don't know. <laughs> Zach, lend me some money. No, I don't lend my money to anyone. But it's not for good, just for some time. I'll pay you back, I promise. I'm saving for a new phone. Why are you so greedy? Gee, stop following me. Nasty boy. Ugh. If they don't give me money, I'll find it myself. Okay. Not here. Maybe here? No. Ugh. Oh, this nut job is asleep. She's got lots of money. Stop, what are you doing? Well, I just wanted to cover you. You wanted to steal my money, that's it. I'm calling the police. You're not. It was my phone. And now it's a piece of metal. <laughs> my phone. <sighs> Tina, finally. Hello, I managed to sneak out. Our house is a cuckoo's nest. What's wrong? Dad went on a business trip and left us with two ladies. You know them? Nope, some of my dad's friends. All right, actually, I wanted to tell you something. Oh, you're so cute. Look just like a hamster. What? Hamster? I forgot what I wanted to say. Try to remember my hamster. Uh, anyway, not only is your dad against us dating, my mom's even worse. She told me to forget about dating and only think about school. Are you leaving me? Huh? Of course not. It's my life, and I won't listen to my mother. I will do what I want. Yeah, I wouldn't want to meet your mother. Judging by your stories, she's not quite all right. Listen, uh, let's go to your place. I really want to see these ladies. Okay. I hope they haven't gotten to my brother yet. Zach, tell us about your dad. Yeah, we really want to know. After all, he's so handsome and muscular. Leave me alone. I won't tell you anything. Tell me who he's going to like more. Me or this nobody. You are a nobody. Ah, I'm so sick of it. Zach, if you want, I'll buy you a fur coat, like cool rappers have, and I'll give you some money. Whoa, money? Gimme. Hey, do you print those dollars at night or what? I work, actually. I'm like someone. I work, too. I'm recycling the bottles. Zach, you want to go with me look for bottles? Back off. I don't want anything. I'll better go play football with the guys. Oh, too bad I'm not his mom. But maybe soon I will be. Don't even think about it. Chris will be mine. Listen, go take a shower. You stink really bad. Beat it. I don't stink. Maybe it's you. <laughs> this is Chris's shirt. Wow. I'd wash his clothes every day. Oh, give it to me. But it's Chris's t-shirt. You ruined it. It's all covered in stains now. It's very stylish. I can wipe my hands on you, too. Don't you dare. Hey, what's going on here? Who are you? We came here to look after the kids. Who are you? I live next door. And this kid ruined all my flowers with his ball. Sorry, I didn't mean to. And who will buy me new flowers? Let me pay for everything. How much do we owe you? A hundred dollars. How much did you say? Now two hundred. Those flowers don't cost that much. Hello? Pay up or I'll call the police. Yeah, right. Got any more questions? Psycho. I'll tell your dad about this, Zach. Tell whoever you want. I'm not afraid of anything. Well, you're not out of our house yet. Honey, I won't be out of here for a long time. Remember that. Mama? Son? 
What are you? Oh, <clears throat> what are you doing at Tina and Zach's? Looking for a dad for you. <laughs> for a dad? Wait, are you her son? Yeah, that's right. Oh, come on, you're kidding. And she says you can't go on dates? Hey, watch your tone. I'm your future mother, I hope. Is that what it's all about? Our dad? Are you really here to make moves on our dad? Mom, shame on you. Instead of raising me, you came here? Real madhouse. I need my personal life too. Especially with a handsome man like your dad. You will never be with our dad. I will. But mom. That's it. Get out of here. Turns out you have a son. I heard everything. No, I'll wait for Chris. Chris is mine. Stop talking about him. Mama, let's go home already. That's right, Drake. Take your mother and go home. Mama, we're leaving. No, I'll stay here and wait for Chris. Kids, I'm home. Where's everyone? Papa, Papa, finally. It felt like you were gone forever. It was a nightmare. You have no idea what we've been through. I don't get it. Tell me, what happened? You better see it for yourself. He's mine. mine. He's mine. Mine. He'll be mine. Uh, uh. Here's what. Papa, do something. Calm down. Stop this now. Chris, you're back. Yay. <laughs> Drake, baby, meet your future dad. Oh, stop it. Papa, kick them out. Enough. Ugh. Dad, you shouldn't have left us with these ladies. They just wanted to charm you. And now I'll have to break up with Drake because of his nut job mother. I'm sorry. It would probably be better if you stay home alone. Of course it would. We told you that from the start, but you didn't listen. I'm really sorry, guys. And these ladies, what were they thinking? We don't need a new mom. I have a surprise for you. Be right back. Maybe he got us a Lego set. We've been asking for it. It's gotta be Lego! Kids, I've been meaning to tell you. After this whole situation, I realized that it's time you meet my girlfriend. Don't be shy. Come on in. Hello. What? Dad, are you kidding me? No. Dina and I have been dating a long time. I knew she'd become a good mother to you. No. No. No! Well, you get to know each other, and I'll go make some tea. Well, looks like we're gonna be a family. This is the end! And what do you think, Zach? How's your ear? Does it hurt? I told you not to throw your ball into my garden. Now you'll plant it for me. I won't. Sure you will. I'm your future mother. No! <laughs> Where are the goods? What is going on today? What an awful day! Okay, where's the paperwork? Let's see. Nothing adds up in these stupid papers! Oh, Daddy, I see your work is in full swing today. Yep. What do you need? Spill the tea. Why did you come to my work? I want to ask for some money. What money? Where do you see any money here? But dad, you own a store. So what? That does not mean I'm a millionaire and can give away money to everyone. The talk is over, go home. But dad. Oh, hi Nikki, what are you doing here? I came to my dad's shop. This is our family business. <laughs> so this hole in the wall is your family's? Have you chosen something, miss? I want this ice cream. I hope I don't get poisoned. Very good choice. Oops, there's a tiny accident here. Ew, this ice cream went bad. How can you sell this in a store? I will definitely complain. Uh, this is Ugh. milkshake. <laughs> Four dollars. Are you nuts? I will rip you apart now. No! no! Not that! You broke my phone! We'll take care of everything now. Give me the money quickly. 
Let's solve everything peacefully. We'll pay you back, but a little later. You have one day to fix everything, is it clear? So completely brazen. Dad, the way you kicked her out is everything. Uh, give me money to get her a new phone? Um, no. You'll find a way to earn the money yourself. What? But Dad, it's not fair. Don't bother me. That's it. I don't have any money. Figure it out yourself. Let's see what's trending. That's kind of interesting. Ooh, I have an idea. Cindy, you won't believe what happened. Wait a second, can't you see I'm working on being popular? It's not that important. I've got real problems. I am the only one who has problems. The video is not being recorded. Cindy, it broke Mia's phone. Yeah, sure. The light is sort of dim. Maybe I should film outside. Cindy, if you do not help me, I will go to jail. What? To jail? Nikki, what happened? Hallelujah, you finally heard me. I smashed that snitch Mia's phone. Really? No, just making stuff up. I don't know what to do. I have no idea where to get the money. Did you ask Dad? He doesn't have any. So, Nikki, maybe get a job then. Me? Work? No way. Well then, pack your bags and go to jail. Oh no, not that. Will you miss me? Don't worry, I won't. <laughs> okay, okay, I was just joking. Calm down. That's it. This is the end. There is no money to reimburse the phone. Get a job. This is the only option. Even if I lend you money, it still won't be enough. So what should I do, Cindy? Oh, you can borrow from Chris. You already like him. So, if you ask him for a loan, you'll get closer to him. No, no, I can't humiliate myself like that in front of Chris. Looks like I have to work. Stop right there. Keep your sour face. Let me make a TikTok with you. I bet there will be millions of views. <laughs> Negative $10,000. I'm almost bankrupt. <laughs> when will my business start making money? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, can we please have two energy drinks? I smell... The youngsters. We'll pay. Can I see your IDs, please? We lost it. Both of you? Well, yeah. The energy drink is very strong. I can't sell it to you. Dad, enough of this show. Can you just give it to us? Chris is actually old enough. Yeah, Mr. Harry. Just one tiny bottle. It won't do anything. Chris is an adult. But you are not. Uh, okay, kiddos. You convinced me. Here are your energy drinks. What is it? Milk. Especially for the little boys without IDs. Ew, I hate milk. Eh, thanks, Dad. Do you know where to go now? Where? where? Play in the sandbox. I can even give you a sand bucket and shovels, so you can build sand castles. Let's get out of here, Drake. Maybe we can get it in another store. Let's go. I wouldn't hope so if I were you. We'll talk at home. I don't want anything at all now. You ruined my mood. Oh, Dad pissed me off today, and now you? Today is the worst day of my life. Even worse than when you found out that the big brush in the bathroom is not a toothbrush, but a toilet brush? <laughs> well, this is the second worst day ever. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, okay, tell me what happened. I broke a phone. Oh, well, I know you're a loser. Well, no biggie, stuff happens. It wasn't mine, but nasty Mia's. Oh, you are in trouble. How are you going to pay for it? With candy wrappers? If only I could, I could go behind bars for that. No one gets jailed for that. Find the money and pay her back. Do you understand that I have to get a job? Where will I go? Well, yes. Uh, what can you do? Oh, I know how to dance! 
Ah, with such dances, you can only beg for money on the streets. Everyone will feel bad for you. Hey, uh, why did you throw it at me? Get used to it. Garbage will be thrown at you often now. <laughs> you see? Even this doesn't work for me. <laughs> Get a job. Drake, are you really that upset and don't want to go out anymore? <sighs> Hello, Nikki. <sighs> Nikki, what's wrong with you? Uh, nothing special. My hand is a little shaky. Well, I am leaving now. Weirdo. Come by or come, come by or come. <sighs> this is gibberish. I should read less about rituals on the web. <sighs> oh, I better finish my favorite task. The best leaders of all times. Good afternoon, whereas... Pasta, flour, bread, shrimp... You must understand me. Ah, something sweet. Cookies, gum, sugar. Sir, I'm looking for the beauty salon. So take the cucumbers. You can make yourself a wonderful mask. Should I wrap it for you? I'm going to the beauty salon. Is this a building? I just got lost. So... You're not a buyer of my store? Fortunately not. We'll take something, please. Gotta go. Wait, I'll give you a very big discount. Take this juice, or tea, really anything. Okay, just stop whining. Give me the juice and I'll go. Wow, maybe that's how I should get clients. Miracle. Who even came up with the idea of working? Why can't money fall from the sky? Good afternoon. Did you call me? Yes, I want to get a job with you. We don't need cleaners. Wait, I want to be a waiter. Well, let's look at your resume. Here you go. What is it? A blank sheet? <laughs> is this some kind of joke? No, I just learned what a resume is, but I didn't understand what to write in there. <laughs> okay, I see you're a funny one. Tell me, will I need to undergo some kind of training? Hmm, training? Yes. Well, okay, do you know what a plate looks like, for example? Gee, this? Awesome, hmm, what about the table? Gee, this? Brilliant. And what if I ask you to bring one to the other? What are you going to bring first? <laughs> Maybe not. The table is too heavy. So? Thus, I will bring a plate to the table. Great. You're such a hot find. You're in. Whoa! Finally, finally, finally! Oh, wow. When can I start? Your shift starts at 3. Don't be late. Long story short, Cindy, I got a job as a waiter! Woohoo! Whoa, that is awesome. I didn't believe that you would get a job till the very last second. I need money, and there is no way out. Well, good luck. Do you know who came to our house today? Well, judging by your face, someone you like. Yeah, it was Chris. Can you imagine he is now friends with my Drake and hangs out at my house all the time? Ah! Chris, 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 you sound like a broken record and there's no other guys around. Yes, Chris is one of a kind, handsome and unique. <sighs> you need to start working ASAP so I can get distracted and you can stop thinking about Chris. No matter how hard I try not to, I think about Chris 24-7 and my work starts at 3. <sighs> well, let's rehearse how you will serve food. Oh, let's do it. I need to do it nicely, yes? I doubt that the word nicely describes you. Waiter, can you be any faster? What am I, Speedy Gonzalez? I move as fast as I can. Uh, come on already. Here's your order. <gasps> oh, there was hot tea there. You messed up. Why did you make the hot tea for the rehearsal? So it's more realistic. <sighs> the world has never seen such waiters. 
But no, it will. Maybe I'll get a bonus out of pity. Then I can buy a phone. Okay, I'm heading out to work. Ah. Oh, I've never seen an uglier uniform. Who came up with this design? Did you say something? I said the uniform is great. The person who designed it is a genius. Yes, yes, this is my design. Here's your name tag. And a client is waiting already. Go take his order. Okay, whatever you say. Just smile. <laughs> Great. Good afternoon. We are glad to welcome you to the Yummy Cafe. What can I get for you? OMG, do you work here? <laughs> what are you doing here? I came to grab a bite before I went shopping. Why? The lawn doesn't work for you anymore? I thought goats only ate greens and don't go to cafes. How do you talk to customers? Do you want me to write a note in the complaint book? Can you call your manager now? Shut up! Come on, just tell me what you want to order. Now we're talking. I'll have a latte and a Caesar salad. Snot and dirt. Did I get it right? Would you like me to add some boogers to your order? One more word, and you'll be kicked out of here. Is it clear? Don't you dare open your mouth in my direction. Your order is ready. Give it to me already. Just be careful, I spat in the cup. What? Do you want me to report you? <sighs> that's it, that's it, I'm silent. Shut up, mediocrity. Otherwise, you will work in a cafe and collect money for my new phone for the rest of your life. What? <gasps> Nikki, you ruined my clothes and my phone in the morning. Manager, I need a manager here ASAP. <sighs> what is going on? Well, this psycho has ruined my clothes. Do you know how much it cost? Sorry, she will be fired. Get out of here. Guys, do you think I will find a way to earn money for the phone? Comment below. Oh, all is gone. I owe Mia for the phone and now for the ruined clothes too. <laughs> Why is all of this happening to me? Are you whining again? Oh, are you normal? This hurts. At least you stopped whining. What if I throw a ball at you so you can feel for yourself? Have you found a job? No, I was fired after 15 minutes of my shift. <laughs> Such a loser. I spend more time when I go to the bathroom. If you have good advice on how to make money, speak up. And if not, goodbye. Hmm, how about washing cars? What? Don't be slow. People pay for this. You just need a cloth and soap. And you can start working. That's an idea, and it doesn't seem like a difficult job. Thanks, bro. Ew, no more hugs. Suck it up. I heard a good idea <sighs> from you for the first time ever. Dang, it's so hot today. I did not see a single car while walking over here. Ugh. I forgot this cloth has soap on it. Ugh. <gasps> oh, wow. Oh, whoa, this is sick. This car is expensive. I can make so much money if I wash it right now. Oh, oops, cheese. What's going on? Nikki, you? Chris, I'm here, um, uh... Why did my car alarm go off? What? Do you have a car? Wow, uh, I was just standing nearby. And what do you have a rag for? Me? Uh, I was walking around, saw your beautiful car and some dirt on it, so I decided to wipe it off. Wow, thank you very much. No big deal, it's just a hundred bucks. What? A hundred bucks? I'm just kidding. <laughs> Wasn't it funny? No. Okay, I'll go. <laughs> what a shame. Why did I even listen to Drake? This kind of income is not for me. Who is calling me now? Hello. Hello, girlfriend. How's work? 
It stinks. I almost embarrassed myself in front of Chris. Good thing he didn't see me washing cars. Why didn't you just tell him? There's nothing bad in it. He would have thought I was a beggar. Chris is a rich guy and he needs a girl like him. Well, I knew you were going to fail. So I sent your resume to a beauty salon. They are already waiting for you there. I'll text you the address. Thanks, you're the best. I'll be waiting for your text. <gasps> wow, I got hired by a beauty salon. Maybe here I will be able to make money? Good afternoon. It took me forever to find your salon. Oh, you should have put on eyeglasses so you could see better. What? I'm just kidding. What do you want to do? I want a beautiful hairstyle. No problem. And evening makeup too. I'm going on a date tonight and I have to look stunning. Maybe no makeup is a better idea? Then for sure everyone will lose their minds. Do your job already. I'm actually paying you. Oh, I love money. Let the magic begin. So what is this brush for? Maybe for foundation? This is a liner brush. Open your eyes. What kind of liner? To do your lips? Are you a professional or what? I'm such a professional, you will be wowed. Uh, let's start with the hair. What do you need scissors for? Well, you obviously have split ends. I will cut them now. Ah, let go. Why are you screaming? It won't hurt. Manager, it looks like she wants to kill me. Help me. <sighs> Easy. I actually tried my best. You owe me money. <gasps> oh, what a day. <laughs> wow. I see you've been through a lot. Guess whose fault that is. I don't even know. You set me up. Great. Am I the one to blame now? You told me to go to that salon and they kicked me out on the street from there. Darn. Your hands are growing out of the wrong place and you're blaming me? Oh, stop it. Why do you have garbage on your head? Oh, looks like I have no talents. Listen. Maybe you could be a janitor. Trash looks really good on you, Nikki. Screw you. I don't know where else I can get money. I've tried it all by now. Oh, look! Where? Right here. This is $100. Wow, cool. How did it get there? I can pay back the phone. <laughs> they just got stuck somehow. <laughs> well, actually, you found it in my room. And I noticed it first. If you want, you can help me get it off the floor. No, 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 no. I just got my nails done. Do it yourself. Great, the money will be mine. Wow, a hundred dollars. Oh, wait, it's souvenir money. What does it mean? Well, I used to have it. I use them as bookmarks. You could have told me earlier. Now I have no money again, and I need a job again. Stop. You're looking for a job, but your dad has his own store. You can ask him to work there. Exactly. How could I forget about my dad? Cindy, I'm off to work. Just don't do it the way you usually do. Mm -hmm. uh, birdies. And now I'm the one who has to wash it all. Daddy, I'm here to see you. So this is the deal. I have no money. Figure out how to earn money for Mia's phone you broke yourself. That's exactly what I wanted to talk about. I want to work for you. Are you sure you're my daughter? Did you get sick or something? Well, Dad, I'll help you and make some money. Well, the latter one is very unlikely. Although it's worth a try. You're not doing anything anyway. And I'll have some rest. Great, I'll start right away. Oh, you know, it takes a lot of learning to become a salesperson. I already know how to do nothing. All buyers need a special approach. That's my specialty. 
This is unacceptable. You sold me expired goods. This can't be real. Everything in our store is fresh. Well, what about your milk then? I will get you. And close down your shop forever. Dad, I see you found a special approach to the client. <laughs> Don't even start. Take the keys and go to work. Cool. Ugh. Such a cool job. You just hang out at the store and organize the goods. Why does Dad complain all the time? Good afternoon. Ah, buyer. <sighs> Are you all right? Uh, yeah, I'm all good. I, I'm just really happy to see you. You are weird. Oh, yeah? Oh, it's so hot in here. Do you want some water? Sure, I can use some. Anything else? More, more water, more water. Of course, we have a lot of water. Here's the money. I can make enough for the phone pretty quickly like that. I could also use a shower. I am fried out here. <gasps> okay, I need a promo to luring clients. Come on in, don't pass by. I need to earn money. Come on in, buy one, get one free. Hot promo oh, only today. look. It's Nikki. Remember how I told you? She broke my phone and now she owes me a lot of money? This one? She wanted to ruin my hair this morning. I almost went bald. Please, come on in. <sighs> oh, hi. Well, have you found the money for my phone yet? I almost have it. Have you printed it out or what? <laughs> <laughs> Mia, you should have reported her to the police. Why are you wasting time with her? Let her suffer. As you can see, she can't figure it out. <laughs> I'll give you your phone money back. I will find a way to pay you back. Why are you so gentle with her? This is just the beginning. I'll set it up so their store gets robbed. Seriously? That way, they won't have any money ever. And they won't be able to make any money. And who will rob it? Where will you find people for that job? Well, you will. You can change and take everything out of there. Mia, have you lost your marbles? I didn't sign up for this. I don't need any problems. Sorry. Thank you, girlfriend. I'll have to look for someone else. As per usual. Nikki, what's wrong? You sounded very upset on the phone. I want to ask you for a favor. I hope you'll understand it in the right way. I'm all ears. Chris, I really need money. Uh, did something bad happen? Did something happen to Drake? No, it's different. Remember that nasty Mia from our school? Well, yeah. That reckless girl. I can't take her. Me too. So I broke her phone, and now I need to buy her a new one. And I don't have any money. Of course I'll help you. Only I don't know when I can give it back. I'm so ashamed. No problem at all. Don't even let it get to your head. We'll figure it out later. I'll help you. Chris, thank you. You are my savior. <laughs> Nobody called me that before. Oh, Chris is a very nice guy. No wonder I like him. And he will also give money for the phone. Stop right there. Don't move. This is a robbery. Would you like some Coke or something else? Nice and cold just to cool down. Don't you get it? I want all the money and everything valuable in my bag. Now. What? The most valuable thing here is me, but I won't fit in the bag. Are you deaf? Or just pretending? Maybe this will make it more clear. Ah, help! There is a thief in the store! Give me your money, fast! <laughs> here you go. Is that all? Where's the money? It's just pennies here. There is no money. The store is not very profitable. You should thank me. I didn't do anything to you. Wait a second. You remind me of someone. What? Where? Stop, you thief! Stop right there! Uh, uh. I'm gonna get you right now! I don't think so. Uh, I wonder how my friend is doing. Probably at work. Come here, you little snitch! What is going on? Let's find out who is behind the mask. Nikki, what's wrong? This thief wanted to take everything out of our store, but I can tell there is woman hair under the mask. Seriously? Let me help you. Uh, 
Uh, stupid hands. You won't get me. Cindy, hold her! Just a little more. We can do it. Ah, back off. Uh, uh. Mia, so it's you? Wow. It really is her. Get your hands off of me. You can't prove anything. Cindy, take her and let's go figure it out. I'm not going anywhere. Of course you won't walk. You'll run instead. Nikki, hold her tight. Uh, uh. So, how's our daughter doing? Nikki, hello, are you here? Is she sleeping? <laughs> if she was sleeping, we would hear her snoring from afar. Oh, son! It looks like we've been robbed! That can't be real. It sure can. Just look at this. The cash register is empty. What did she do here? Ah, I will take you to court. Nikki, can you explain what's going on? Why is our cash register empty? And why are you holding me up? Mr. Harry, you won't believe what happened. I am very curious about what could have happened. Let that psycho tell you. Can you imagine? They knocked me to the floor, twisted my arms, and threatened me to death. Tell the truth now, Mia. Long story short, she wanted to rob our store. Huh, there is nothing to steal here. You can't prove anything, okay? And by the way, you still owe me for the phone. Yeah, sure. What else? If you don't give me the money, I'll hand you over to the police. I think it's worth looking at the security cameras. Everything should be clear then. I'm in. Let everyone see how she threatened me with a gun. What? Cameras? How come? Do you even have money to install cameras? You know what? Just to sum it up, I used to owe you for the phone, and now you owe me for the moral damage. And that's twice as much. What? <sighs> hey, choke on your phone and your money, jerks. Nikki, I trusted you in the store for one day, and you made so many problems. Dad, at least we don't owe anyone anything now. Oh, shoot, I just forgot to tell Chris. Chris, Chris, it's so good you were here. Oh, Nikki, I just bought you a phone. I decided to buy it myself. Well, I don't need a phone anymore. I detained a thief in the store, and the thief happened to be me, so it's complicated. Oh, wow, that's crazy. I don't owe her either a phone or money. So keep the phone for yourself then. I don't know. Maybe it's better if you return it. And thanks a lot for helping me. Oh, come on. Take it. It's yours now. What? I can't take it. It's very expensive. Well, consider that a gift. A gift? We've known each other for a long time. And we can get to know each other oh, better. Oh, Cindy did not believe me that I would ever go on a date with you. What are you talking about? I'm just kidding. Let's go for a ride already. I have never ridden in such a car. Please. Oh, I can't believe it. It's not the worst day today, but the best when day ever. Ecstasy. Get high when you're next to me. I'm in 